You know, what I really liked about the second book is, is that it starts talking about values and the principles of the revolution. Yeah. And I think that's key. You know, we share similar values yeah, well exactly. and views on, on the world, which I think it's, it's possible. One of them and that we are pushing hard is uh, uh, decarbonization. Yeah. We're going to launch our commitment on decarbonization on February. That means we're going to 99% renewable and clean electricity. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And now the challenge is we're going to plug that matrix onto transportation to reduce mm -hmm. dramatically mm -hmm. the, the emissions and to reduce the usage of fossil fuels until mm -hmm. we don't use those anymore. I know you play also a very important role in preserving, let's say, your forests. You have a young population, you have a, a relatively well-educated population. You can use the fourth industrial revolution to create, um, let's say, fast track growth for your country. My commitment will be to add value. We'll be part of the Young Leaders yes, Initiative. This is Merkel, Tony Blair. Um, they were all, even uh, President Putin. They were all young global leaders before. Mm. So um, if I take you, if I take Chancellor Kurz, and the New Zealand Prime okay. Minister, the three youngest leaders of governments are here. So I know you have many uh, beautiful things in your country, but it characterizes the diversity, and at the same time, everything goes up. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. We call it Mount Crystal. <laughs> Thank you for your books. They are really inspiring.